well just arrived at Turkey Point uh, in Bunbury so hoping to camp here the night there's a boat ramp just behind me so put the boat in there interesting drive through the Ferguson Valley seeing the Frog Place and Gnomesville again Gnomesville they've tidied right up <laughs> So yeah, around at Turkey Point, which is on the estuary near the, what they call the cut. I've done a video on that one, so if you have a look back, or I'll put a link in there, um, you'll see that and a little bit about this place. So we'll get out and have a look around. I thought I just saw some dolphins out there. Out on the cut, absolutely beautiful day. These boats around, just got the motor humming away. Got a popper on one side and just a little deep diver. No, uh, yeah, dolphins have been around, but couldn't ask for a better day. Well, it's been a very interesting day. The people behind me, they're from Queensland and had just finished watching one of my videos not long ago, so I was catching up with them. The lady that was swimming with the dolphins, g'day. It was really nice having a chat to you and having the dolphin come up and swim around my feet. The moon's up and shining on the water, so it's about 7 o'clock now and it's all gone quiet. Everybody's gone home and the free campers are slowly starting to arrive. Magic spot. See what tomorrow brings.
Well, I've just pulled into Drake's Brooks, Drake Brook Weir, just before the town of Harvey. I've seen the sign a hundred times and never stopped. So, what a magic place. I'll get out and have a look around. I might even have to put the drone up here. Lovely green picnic areas. There's a few campers here. And for kayaking, perfect. So let's go and have a bit of a look. Well, I wasn't going to stop here, I was going to carry on up to Dwelling Up, but I just spotted this little side track. I found a lovely little campsite. Oh, there goes a one Mustang flying in the background. Don't know if you heard that. So, sadly, somebody's had a party here and left all their rubbish, but apart from that, looks like there's a few different tracks down further where you can get right on the water. The main area is just out over here. The water's crystal clear, so I'm actually thinking I might have a coffee and then go and have a swim. This is the fire maple, but you can also buy them I've seen now in Kmart. For about 50 bucks and with a gas bottle on the bottom it's probably the most useful thing I've got my camping gear to stop make a quick cup of coffee even set a fry pan on top there's an attachment for that what a great spot very popular the cars are coming and going like crazy up there and the boys have got a fishing rod so obviously they're chasing something out here Nothing wrong with this pastry that I've got at the petrol station either. Well, I'm at Boddington, 
lovely little free RV spot here for 24 hours right on the water and if you want to have a look back you'll see I've done a video on it before excuse me for not looking up I'm just making a hamburger I'm getting a bit hungry so yeah Boddington uh, check out the video I've done it before in the RV camping site here came through dwelling up and really wanted to stop but I thought no I won't go back in the cooler months a year take the wife back with me and we can have a good look around because it was very busy being a long weekend so that's the trip uh, been to a few different places that you can camp for free and have water views and that was basically what I was looking at some lakes dams and the ocean well estuary so g'day to all the people I met out there um, absolutely fantastic Ben and M people camped in front and behind me so cheers for watching please give me a thumbs up subscribe if you wish I'm more than happy to have subscribers and please leave a comment or if you've got any ideas or places that you know of leave them in the comment as well so thanks very much stay safe out there and keep the shiny side up and I'll catch you next time cheers